Friends, a few days from now, we will celebrate the feast of Pope St. John Paul II. His papacy spanned more than 25 years and offers us a lot of catechetical insights. But in celebration of the month dedicated to Our Lady, let us go through some of his thoughts on Mary's maternal love. Pope St. John Paul II grew up during turbulent times in his native country, Poland. His dedication and devotion to Our Lady began when he sought refuge in her after the death of his own mother, before he was nine. Then, as he continued to grow in age and in faith, the writings of Louis de Montfort helped intensify his love for Mary. The Blessed Mother's influence on his life was so great and his love for her so immense that he adopted the motto, Totus Tuus, or Totally Yours, from the prayer of Montfort to Our Lady. Pope St. John Paul II believed that Mary always leads us towards Jesus, and so he said, Authentic Marian devotion is Christocentric. This is evident in his several writings and addresses about her. Now, while Mary's motherhood of Jesus was rooted in her consent to be his bearer when the angel Gabriel visited her, Pope John Paul II leads us to another poignant scene in the life of Jesus and Mary that also deserves reflection. Standing at the foot of the cross of Jesus, Mary united herself with his suffering. The saintly Pope tells us, this association with Christ's sacrifice brought about a new motherhood in Mary. Not only was she the mother of Jesus, she also became the mother of the beloved disciple, indeed of every disciple, of every human being. Then he added an interesting facet. Mary's spiritual motherhood is a sharing in the power of the Holy Spirit, of the giver of life. It is the humble service of her who says of herself, Behold, I am the handmaid of the Lord. Friends, Mary's consent in giving flesh to the Word launched her lifelong service. Her service was highlighted in her embrace of her son's sufferings. She embraced us with the vitality of the Holy Spirit as her children too. She did not live for herself, but always for others, leading them, leading us, always to her Son and Lord. From these few points, we see how Mary points us to Jesus. In 2003, Pope John Paul II encouraged all the young people gathered for the 18th World Youth Day to find in Mary a mother, as he has experienced. There you go, brothers and sisters. O Mary, our mother, look upon us and keep us always in your care. Saint Pope John Paul II, pray for us.